Howdy everybody, this is the Roaming Prepper channel. I'm your host Pete and thank you for coming to check out the video. As always, any recommendations and suggestions I give you are purely that, recommendation and suggestion. Your individual situation will be different than a, the person next door, so work with what you can in your given situation. So I got a lot of feedback on the me cursing at the gas station because of the price of gas. Uh, everybody started filling in what their prices are and the general consensus is it's at least doubled in some states and in places like California and New York City it may have tripled. It's absolutely insane and there's really none of, nothing us individually can do about it. But there are some things you can do as a person to minimize the impact in your own life. I'm going to share a few of these with you. One was a great recommendation by one of the uh, commenters who is a semi-truck driver who said he's just driving slower. He found that if he drives about 10, he said about 15 or 10 kilometers per hour slower, um, he gets much more efficiency out of his semi. He's not hauling butt left and right, slamming on the brakes, jackrabbit starts. So change the way you drive, it can drastically affect your fuel efficiency. Another thing you can do, make sure your tires are fully inflated. Now, obviously, having tires with good, good tread and in good condition really, really help, but those are expensive. You may not be in a position to have the newest tire possible, but you can make sure it's inflated. You can also make sure that you don't jackrabbit start and stop at the lights to save some gas. I'd also optimize your trips. We're all used to go to the store for milk, go to the store for cereal, go to the store for bread. No, instead, make a list and if you absolutely don't need it right away wait and then make one big trip to the store and save yourself from going back and forth eight different times because you're just burning up gas and you're hurting your own budget another thing if you guys can have membership cards to like costco or sam's go shopping with friends or family as a group Everybody can use the SAMS card to take advantage of the bulk purchases, but each one pays their own way. That way you're not Venmoing the one person and making them crazy. There are other things you can do, such as making sure your oil changes are done, your air filters are done, and you've map the most efficient routes to and from whatever destination you're going to. Guys, it's not going to get better in the short term. It's going to get worse, I'm afraid, before it gets better. So be smart, collaborate, and think about ways you can save money. If I missed anything, throw it in the comments below. I'm interested to hear. Take care. God bless. Godspeed.